fantastic. And set it up. Wow. Aspinall. Finishing up to be finished in the first 50. set. For Danny Bagish, the American PDC World Championship debutant meets top. Yeah, brilliant, brilliant, set. brilliant. Danny From Danny Bagish, he takes the first set here in stunning style. He's some character all right. And Bagish leads Nathan Aspinall by a set to nil. And when we come back, we'll have set two for you. Don't want to get in his way. I wouldn't argue with him with a face like that right now. Well, he's missed a treble 11. Danny Bagish, so that leaves the door. 94. Very much open. A slight last start as well. Tops for Aspinall, now double 10 for the set. Yeah, well, that didn't take long, did it? He's put the record straight immediately in straight legs, three legs to nail in that second set. Last start in hand for the double 10. Oh, it's, a, it's an opportunity for Nathan to come back for the first 10 plus finish in this match. And he wants his favourite tops. Yeah, and he gets it! Nathan, Nathan Aspinall has turned around so from missing Nathan eight in the first. Danny Bagish looking at this last throw at this World Championships. But what a player he is. A player we definitely will see at the Q School. Fantastic. Yeah, we wish him well. There's a marker for Aspinall. It's the number 18! That's relief! Nathan Aspinall because it wasn't a smooth ride in any way, shape or form. Danny Bagish did a great job there, opening that first set. And great respect between these two players. And ladies and gentlemen, that was... Looking for another 57. 96. Nico Yukla, 68. Kurtz wants 68. Well, now 65, so 15 will lead Bull. He prefer the treble. I'll just go straight for the fat 15 to make sure about that at Bullseye, which he's now missed. So he's opened the door to Joe Cullen. Brilliant start to the visit. Brilliant finish to the visit. Joe Cullen hit back there to some tune, didn't he? The rock star hitting all the right notes in the final three legs. He was two legs down. Kurtz missed a dart. Double 20 to win the set. Cullen roared back with a 116 and a 13 data, and that leg we just saw there with that clean 80. He's doing well on the tour, on the Pro Tour events which are held in the. Joe needs double 18. Took this out in the previous set. That was actually the first leg he won. The previous one won six, and he's done it again. Well, his darts kind of lay down. That is not in the way. That is not in the way. And for the 18, it would have been two singles to a double. Now we may have to hit the bullseye. Oh, he's missed it. He's missed the big 18 on the treble. Nico Kurz will have three darts and a double to take out the 15th seed. Joe Cullen taking his time. Thank you. Crowd most certainly not helping. Gotta work his way down. He does work his way down. He works his way in. The world championship woes carry on for Joe Cullen. It just doesn't happen here from him. But the night belongs to Nico Kurz with a 93. 11 dart leg, maybe. Double 18. Oh, oh the brilliant that top. Nice that was convincing. And at one stage there, only a matter of two or three minutes ago, it was very much advantage van der Pass. But Max Hopp has turned that set around. And he leads this match by one set to nil. And set two. It's the pressure on van der Pass here, doesn't it? That's a great start, though. Double 19 for a 1-5-8. That is brilliant. Absolutely brilliant from Big Ben. Now, this is a great opportunity for Benito van der Pass to level this match. Brilliant! Brilliant! Game on here at the Alexander Palace. Benito van der Pass breaks the throw and it's level one set apiece here. For Benito. Now, two darts in hand for Hop, double 16 for the set. 
Only needs a one. Only needs a one. In prime position, going to get six darts from here. Oh, this is better. Double 14 for a 148. Oh my goodness. Where has he found that from? Pressure back on Van der Pas to hold his strong. Big 20, you leave yourself a ton. Van der Pas has hit the double 18 anyway, so that level is. It up and two sets apiece. He has left to leave 32. He's left a treble 15 to leave the 36 to finish this match up. And it's a great last set from Max Hop if he can take this out. Double 18 for the match. It's been a real battle here. And Max Hop nails the double 18. Jubilation in the Hop camp. It was a real battle there. Benito van der Pas dominated at times. Max Hopp far from his best, but he edges through. Plow on, no, plow on to leave double 16. Will it count? Will it matter? James on the first Does not set. Matter. Peter on. Mind over matter. Didn't matter and Peter Wright didn't mind. Romps through the first set. Sorters off stage. Back to Santa's workshop. Well, he's looking to leave double 12. That's the ideal scenario. And if he can slot one in the middle there, that's well, exactly what he will have done. Now, will it be enough? Two. He forced the mistake out of Malikdem. 13 now. It wasn't a disastrous miss. Yeah, he got lucky there. A five was a disastrous miss. Right. Double seven. That could be a disastrous miss of a single. If he hits double seven, all will be well in the world for Noel. And there it is, in the most unorthodox of circumstances, the most bizarre 68 you can ever win. Of course, Wayne Marlow can read Peter Wright's mind. You might remember at the match play where Wayne fancied him for the fish. And he took it out. <laughs> we, talk, we talk before he plays. <laughs> now double 13. Oh my! Highest finish of the match. Still, the wait goes on yes. at the World Championship. But in the context of this match, it's a oh, brilliantly it's played leg. Blast. If he can finish the Nico Kurt shot to win the set. And he does, he goes pop, pop on the Nico Kurt shot. And here they are to push Peter Wright all the way. Remember, Wright's already missed a dart to win. He was at this target. The yeah, Mackle hit, Malaga hits. No Malaga. Then 54 54. I very much doubt he's going to go that way. A bedfellow leaves double 10 to save his skin. To Dude. save his snaky skin! Oh. 100. Did you require 32? To end what has been an absolute sterling match. Game. That Shot. is the double Nine 16 minutes. that sees Peter, Peter Wright. Wright through. Joe's, please, so she should be. Noel Malikdem and Peter Wright have put on an absolute darting show for you. It went down to the very, very last leg. Peter Wright last year lost to Antonio Ocinas. He nearly lost to Noel Malikdem, who had a dart of bullseye to beat him in that final set. But Peter Wright showed his class. He gets it done. He is through to the second round. We'll play Keegan Brown or Sago Asada. What dancing entered so